Hi guys. So this pain, face pain story is that the Snow White went to the forest and been attacked by the uh, bad wolves. So basically that's how it's gonna look now. And um, so I just put foundation on my face and I'm gonna make a gap between my wig and I'm gonna do my black eyebrows to match the wig and I'm using Snazzaro black face paint. I'm gonna do quickly my eyebrows. They have to be black and thick. Just take baby wipe and clean up. It'll be fine. Because this is makeup and it's gonna be this eye, I think gonna be messy. Anyway, so it doesn't have to be perfect eyebrow, it just has to be black. So I smudge it in and I'm gonna do the rest. So while my eyebrows are drying, I'm gonna take like rosy any blush you have for your face and I'm gonna Give a little bit of rosiness to my cheeks, not too much. Snazzaro red and I make little scrapes on my eye as a wolf attacked me. So I'm grinding like this here and wiggling out. So I'm gonna do next one the big one. Probably end up in the small, like this. Wait, that's not straight, but it's okay. Now I'm going to see a little bit bigger about the side. And the last one. Okay, so we don't have to be perfect. A little bit more redness. Messier it is, it's better. The last one I have. Now, while the scrape is drying, it's not done, nope. And uh, I'm taking red lipstick. It's a um, MAC Ruby Woo. It's a very, very nice color. It's like a blood color. I really like that. And it's matte. So I'm doing my red lips. Cool. And I'm taking the same brush and I'm gonna do just like a little bit further in. So as I was fighting this wolf and I was I was biting him too and scraping and everything. So and I want to do scrapes over here too on my neck. Three. Three on the side. Now I'm taking another brush. skinny too and I'm gonna use a little bit brown color it's not a brown I'm using loaded it's loaded with color and I'm going on one side only of the scar over here we're gonna out Over 
yourself. I think we'll go for this one a bit longer. Now the same on the neck. Maybe you see my previous video and I don't scrape on hand, but look on the eye. It looks so good. And now let's get them dry. I'm taking a skinny brush again and I'm taking black color. And really, really light hand, I'm gonna trace on the beside the brown, outside the brown, I mean. Just a tiny bit. Give that depth. Okay, and the same on the neck. Got it from far away. Yeah. Now I'm taking a little bit bigger brush and I load it to white. Then I took the towel, paper towel, and I dried out and I load it again, no water. And I'm gonna go just on one side over here to avoid to give that 3D effect. All the way around, and then on that side, just a tiny bit. I'm just on this one and some bigger again red brush and just just brush it out. Now I'll do the same on my neck and I'll come back. So I'm back. So I'm wiping the brush in a baby wipe now and I'm going all around just a little bit because I didn't like it. It was way too much white. See some blobs like of the white. So I kind of have to smooth it out. Just a little bit. Now, and I'm taking the same red brush and wiping in baby wipe. Then I'm wiping in my hand, dry it out in a circle. And I'm gonna smooth around. my finger and kind of smudging out to see a little bit up and same on this side now I'm gonna go all around with my fingers and I'm dragging out. Now watch your eye go up. Maybe I'm right in here. Whenever you think you need some red, and smooth with your fingers. Now I'm gonna do the same over here. Oh my I'm going back the red more where I need to make it bloodier. Just double, double 
looks really handy when you move. Yeah, but probably too much hair in here and I have to change for white. But that's okay, you can fix anytime, go back and fix it if you feel that you need to fix. Okay, now I've got too much red and I'm going all the finger. I want to give that blood depth in here, just in the middle. And give it fresh blood. And pink ball. Best tool is your finger. I have to see it's very hard to do on the neck because you can't see properly. Okay. Now all the face paint is done. And I'm gonna do now my eyes. I'm gonna put some mascara and maybe eyeliner. We'll see. Now when it's all done, I do my eyeliner with um, face paint too. It doesn't matter actually, and it looks a bit messy, but it's okay because I had a fight with both, and my makeup could be a bit more runny. So I'm looking at the French now, probably to do what I want to see makeup. So I'm gonna push on one side like that, leave the gap here. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope I inspired you for Halloween outfits and you can use that makeup for any outfit or just like for zombie or just whatever. It's just an idea because like I just wanted Snow White to fight the wolf. But please subscribe my channel and give a thumbs up if you like this video and happy Halloween.